morning. This is Renee, and this is a collective reading. This is a timeless reading. So when you find this message is when you will receive the message, is when it's meant for you. For further clarification, make sure to take a look at your sun sign, uh, your moon, and your rising. For further clarification, when I was meditating on your energy, I was feeling like someone has lied to you, someone is deceiving you, someone is trying trying to steal what you have. And you have the Ace of Swords, the Sun, and the Queen of Swords. Okay, so with the Ace of Swords, I feel like the truth is going to come out. The truth is going to be revealed, and it's going to provide you with a new beginning on the situation. Um, the Queen of Swords, the Queen of Swords, I feel like she's going to provide you with the information that you need in order to make your decision. Um, after you do make your decision, you do have the sun. Uh, so I feel like once your decision is made, uh, you'll be happy with the decision that you make. And, um, you'll be able to move forward. You do have the devil in your challenge position. So I feel like this could be you or this could be someone else who's obsessing over the situation. Someone's trying to steal something from you. I'm feeling like this is in love. Maybe an acquaintance or a friend has tried to steal something that was yours. Maybe love, maybe a possession. But someone's lying, someone's deceiving you. Yeah, and you have the Ace of Wands in reverse. So this is gonna leave you in an energy that's gonna make you feel stagnant. You're not going to want to do anything in this situation for some time. You're going to isolate. But I do see that you have many options that are available. You're going to go through your options. You're going to weigh your options. This could be also you daydreaming about the situation, how it could have been prevented. But I feel like what this person is saying is this person who has deceived you, um, I feel like they're saying that you weren't available at the moment. You weren't, you weren't giving them enough attention. You weren't giving them enough attention in the situation. So they looked elsewhere to gain the attention that they needed. But overall, I feel like you're a very attractive person. Um, this person who has deceived you actually seduced the person that we're talking about. They, per they seduced your person. But your person is looking for more contentment. They're looking for a resolution to the situation. They're looking to find happiness. And I believe they're looking to find happiness with you. They are seeking your forgiveness. 
in this situation. Yeah, and they also have the Knight of Cups in reverse. So this person is scared to come forward. They're scared to come close to you. Um, they want to give you a message, but they are scared of how you will react, what you might say. Um, they really don't want to end things with you. They want your forgiveness in this situation. Let's see what they have to say. I feel you leaving me behind. So yeah, I believe this person is scared that you're not going to give them any forgiveness. They're scared that you just want to end the relationship. I think they feel it. It was my fault, but I blame you. So yeah, I feel like they're making the excuse that you weren't available at the moment. You weren't giving them enough attention. So they're blaming you for the situation. They're blaming you for their actions. But they know it's their fault. But they want to put the blame on you so that they take some of that fault off of themselves. But you know the truth. It is not your fault. You did not do anything wrong. Yeah. So yeah, see, I knew exactly what I was doing. So they knew exactly what was going on in the situation. They knew exactly how things were going to unfold. They just went along with it anyway. They knew what they were doing. I know I messed up everything. So yeah, they feel like they've lost you. They feel like they've totally lost you in this situation. I hope you can forgive me one day. So yeah, they're, they're want, really wanting a resolution for the situation. They really want you to forgive them for what they're going through, uh, what they put you through, I should say. Um, and that's totally up to you. I can't make your decision for you. But um, I'm, I can just let you know that this person wants you to forgive them. I couldn't let you get close to me. So they're they're holding back their feelings. They are they're not wanting to take responsibility for their actions. Let's see, I don't want that one. I want this one. Yeah, they, they don't want to take responsibility for their actions. Um, but know that you have the sun card and you also have the ace of swords. So the truth has come out. You are knowledgeable of everything now. Um, everything's out in the open. Everything is in your control. You are controlling the situation. Um, so wherever you decide to go in this situation, you're going to be content with it. You're going to find happiness because e even if you decide not to be with this person who has lied or cheated on you, even though you decide not to be with them, you are going to gain happiness. There's still happiness in the cards for you. Spirit is letting you know that you are being protected. You are um, in this situation. You will find happiness regardless of the outcome. I just had a card fall. Ooh. Okay. Yeah. New doors will be open for you. Um, you're going to be discovering a lot of things about these people that you're surrounding yourself with. And it's going to leave you with, with a lot of decisions to make. Um, your doors will be opening to the decisions that you need to make. Number 34 may be very important to you right now. Um, it may be the age of the person that you're dealing with. It may be your age. Um, but I also feel like this number is very significant to you. Okay, and two cards wanted to come out. 
yeah you're you're kind of feeling like it is what it is you really don't want to move on the situation but you really need to make decisions um you have the number six in this situation and um spirit is letting you know to think out of the box beyond the ordinary and you are an extraordinary person and this person knows that they deceived you they know that they lied and cheated and they really don't want to lose you because they know that you are an extraordinary person they know that you're someone who they can build a life But you may receive a gift in this situation. You may receive a gift, even if it's just a gift of comfort, a gift of um, soul searching. Uh, the Spirit is letting you know that, that, that you will be gaining a gift in this situation. Number 37. Uh, you will be gaining a gift in this situation. And at the bottom of the deck, you have close encounters. So... If you decide to end things with this person, you may receive another offer from another person. This may be um, a new love that would be coming in because you have cut loose the old ties. And let's see. Let's get some further clarification on this because I'm, I'm not feeling how we're leaving it. I feel like there's something else. Okay, yeah. You're going to have healing in this situation. Yeah, um, and I see that you have a lot of hope. You have a ho lot of hope for this situation. This, this situation, although you're feeling heartbroken at the moment, you're feeling um, like clarity is not going to come close. But you will have hope and clarity. Um, you maybe even be the spotlight for someone else. Yes, and you have the sun again. So, yes, yeah, Spirit is letting you know that you will be happy through the situation. You will find happiness. See, so you have the sun card twice in this reading. And yeah, you have the Knight of Swords. So after the truth comes out, you may feel like just leaving this all behind. You may feel like um, whatever it is that was done to you or whatever someone did to deceive or, or cheat on you, that this isn't worth saving. But you're going to find happiness and healing in this situation because of that. And you also have the four of wands at the bottom so i believe with the four of wands you do have support um you do have other friends that are coming to your aid um you have family who is supporting you through this situation and there may be a celebration maybe where you are going to meet someone new there's going to be social gatherings that will give you an opportunity to meet this new person if this is what you want to do. Yeah, and you also have the Queen of Wands. So you're, you're actually manifesting this. You're manifesting someone new in your life who's going to love and care for you the way that you want to be treated. And I feel like you're a very attractive person. You're very bold and assertive. You have the confidence. So I feel like with this confidence you should um, move forward move forward something better is in store for you yeah and you have the justice card so uh, whatever these people did to you you're gonna have your karma you're gonna have your justice in the situation and you also have the hierophant so yeah, you're feeling fully enlightened over the situation. This may be even someone coming in who's going to give you a proposal of marriage. Um, but yeah, the, these people in your life, 
that are not doing right by you, they're actually going to get their justice. Karma's coming their way. Okay, that is your reading collective. As I said, this reading is timeless. So uh, when you find this message is when it's meant for you. And make sure to like and subscribe. Hit that bell so that you don't miss any readings. And I will see you on the next one. Thank you, collective. Love and light. Many blessings.